Hey everybody, the Bonga's back. Welcome to part 2 of Let's Play Neo, Dragon of the North DLC. Alright, in the last episode, we got started in Yokai Country, and I'm not going to alert this guy. <laughs> yeah, let's just, uh, keep it cool. Yeah, we started Yokai Country, which is the first stage in the Tohoku region. And now, we are just gonna go through this little cave area. I just realized there was another guy over there. I should have just tried to kill him instead. Well, this is gonna alert both. Wow, I was trying to figure out, like... You're gonna let me target this guy? Anyway, this Rokiro Kubi, which is a new type of yokai that we encountered in this DLC, doesn't seem to care. It was just playing coy for a while while I was dealing with this human. And now it just became an easy mark. Again, I'm really glad this armor build does allow me to recover health every time I just absorb Emrita of any kind. It's been a total game changer so far. Oh, there's Yokai Fog over here. There's also a cliffside. Wonder if I can actually get the get a sneak attack on him if he doesn't see me. Yep, it worked! <laughs> I, I don't know what I picked up there, but it looks like it should have fell, and it didn't. Well, this level 152 Revenant was not very quiet at all. Okay, it looks like there's only one way to go, and that's across the bridge. Whoa, 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 wait a minute, what is that?! Whatever it is, it's big. Okay, I'm gonna have to use the um, Guardian Spirit. Namahage Horn. It's a demon harvester. Please be careful, Shigizane. That's a name I haven't heard in a long time since Pokemon Conquest. Man, I still love playing that game. A lot of people really enjoyed it. Every now and then I still get people that comment to my Pokemon Conquest Let's Play. Okay, it looks like there's something over down there. But I don't think I can get it just by walking off the bridge. I gotta find a way to open that gate. Cody over here. Place is swarming with fiends. Yeah, I can totally see that. Alright, let's play the sneak game for now. So I see two. Oh, let me get this guy. Oh, nice. Got him killed before he can even do an attack. Ooh, treasure chest. That's a good thing I uh, offloaded a lot of my inventory before I uh, entered this level. Because I have a feeling it's going to fill up fast. Let's take a look. Um... Doesn't really say what my inventory is now. Oh, 253. So it's a little over half max. Doesn't take long. I came in from that way. Actually, no, I came in through here. Looks like there's a Godam on the other side of this fence. Whoa, 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 whoa. If 
hopefully this guy will be de-aggroed anytime soon. Oh god, it was a Rokiro Kubi! So some of them actually could have guns! I don't know if he's gonna use it anymore. But that kinda like, uh, totally nullified my whole, uh, theory. Oh god. There's a Namahage there too! Okay, from the looks of things, they have horns. Could I break those like the Yoki as well? Whoa. Whoa. Is that a grab? Yeah, these guys apparently have a grab move. Oh. That was close. I actually had to use an elixir that time. Does that guy still know I'm around? He's looking. But he's not looking at me. Can I just hit him in the head? Okay, that answered that question. Slender Vertebra. Okay, that must be the Rokiro Kubi's, uh, material from what's off their body. That's cool, I guess. I'm just gonna call them Rokus from now on. Not to be confused with the actual, uh, media device called a Roku. It's just Rokiro Kubi is just too long of a name. Seriously. <laughs> oh, geez. I wonder if I'm going to be attacked by a uh, mimic. Telling me to calm down. There, there. I still remember how those guys work. Just use the exact same gesture that they use, and they won't attack you. I'm glad that I'm still getting decent uh, Kingo's armor if I ever want to go with that build. But another armor build I might want to transition to in the future could be the Tatanashi armor. And I think it's like medium or a heavy build, but it allows you to continue attacking even when you're attacked. Okay, now he's finally dead. Oh, that one's a human. Surprise! Get up there through that way. Oh, look, there's that uh, gate that I couldn't open before. Okay, it didn't take long to get there. Oh, God. Look at this. There's like two Namahages over there bundled together. I don't want to face that. That's a suicide mission and a half. Oh, apparently these guys are weak against fire. Either that or I actually hit them right in the horn. Which in that case, huh, lucky shot. Okay, we open the way back to the shrine. In case things go horribly wrong, which they likely will. Question is, 
How do I get up there? Holy shit, there's actually three! What the fuck? I think one of them got alerted. Jeez, you know the one I fight was was not even one of those three? That was actually a fourth one. God. This is getting a little raw. Kick that down. How the hell do I get around here? Oh, that's how. Don't know if that's the intended way to do it, but that's how I did it. Let me look around here. Looks at things. Maybe that is the intended way. Yeah, you can't walk on this. Okay, I was already here. There are stairs. Bet you there's another gate I can't open. God damn, there's always a gate. There's a Kodama around this fence. This building seems safe now. The only inhabitant is, uh... Long gone. And by long gone, probably somewhere within the last three minutes. I'm surprised I still even had my first death yet. I thought that would have happened any time now. <laughs> I mean, it's gonna be due. Okay, there has to be a better way to get around this. Whoa, whoa. What? What the hell? There, there. Okay, okay. You didn't appreciate that. Let me give you an applause. No, 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 no! You don't get to applause! Okay, 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 we're fine. Everything is cool. Everything is okay. Whatever we're fighting is below us. And not on the same level. Which is good. Now, it looks like it's intended that we're supposed to go up this way. Have I not been up here? How did this guy not even hear that? He didn't hear a ladder being climbed? Death? Wait, wait, wait. Is there, there was nothing else here at all? No. This was literally just to get to a guard tower with ammo. Or maybe we're supposed to go down here. Okay. Oh. Okay. That is definitely looking like a no-no right there. At least for now. So much for that for now. It looks like we do have to go fight him. If I can get a good view of the horn, though, I think we might be in business. Oh, never mind. That's not a Namahage. That one doesn't even have a horn. I 
should have recognized the heads right there. Nice. Getting more stuff. Looks like that was the only enemy in this cave. Wait a minute. I'm near where those three Namahages are, aren't I? But I think I went past them. Oh, well, look, I think I did. Yeah, they're right there, you see? They don't know I'm here. Let's just be a little bit more quiet. I don't think I had to... Oh, no. Okay, I'm gonna be... Oh. <laughs> okay. 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 I can't get up here. There is a bridge. Oh, no. Someone else is shooting at me, too. I just saw. What is this? The DLC variety pack? Get one of every creature! That we just debuted. Have fun. I hope there isn't a Kadama within that entire flank of Namahages. I don't think I'd be ready for that. I'm just saying. Like my Neo skills are good, but they're not great. Can I help you, sir? Are you lost? I think the only thing that is lost is your life. <laughs> Yu Yu Hunter did not do too well. Wait, what the hell? Oh god. It's a dude with a cannon. Well, he can't hit me from here. Get somewhere where I can hit him. Did I get him? I think I got him. Nice. It worked. Even if it is cowardly, it worked. I feel like they're just going to keep throwing these guys in as an excuse. Like, I've seen a lot of them already, these Namahages. Like, it's going to get to a point where they're going to be showing up a bit too much. At least this early. It says there's a Kodama near here. Is it, do I have to climb up? Yeah, I think I do. Gotta be in this. Oh, it can't be in this cabin. There's not enough room. Oh, look, there it is. Oh, pop up. Thank you. God, there's like 10 Kadama on this level, but I feel like I should be nearly getting them all. Any closer to that uh, gate I saw? I have no idea. Oh. Oh, that guy's dead. 
Oh no. Oh yes. Ah man, picking that spell has been doing tremendous wonders against these guys alone. I wasn't planning on letting my guard down. But I think that's the boss over there. Plus, I found all the Kadama, too. Which pleases me greatly. Should I go to the shrine now? You know what? I'm gonna need all my stuff back, so yes. I don't have enough for a level up. That's disappointing. It's a good thing I still have sloth ready. Alright, I guess I'll just have to run past them and get right in that gate. Sloth is in tow? Let's do this. Oh god. Look at this guy's arm. Oh god, that hurts. He's pretty fast, as you can tell. Wait, did Sloth wear off already? Whew. He hits pretty hard. Oh! Oh, that, that was a nasty combo. Oh, he's ready for the slam. Okay, well, that's our first DLC boss. And this is exactly as I expected it to be. Pretty hard. Alright, let's try this again. Oh, I, I gotta go change the options. Did I, did I miss? Oh, I, I missed out on the Guardian Spirit. I forgot where it was. I think I lost like 2 million Amrita over there. That sucked. Oh god, my Facebook messages are just blowing up at this very time. Well, I'm gonna have to change the options later because I'm already committed to this fight. Definitely breaks your your block really fast. Whoa. Okay, from what I'm noticing, he can do a jump and then do a sword slash too. So he's got a fair amount of combo action going. I gotta do a better job figuring out this guy's attack pattern and what his attack strings are. Basic game settings. There's a one for cutscenes. Skip watch movies automatically. There we go. There, I did it. As long as this guy doesn't get a first strike on me, I'm good. Whew! Just dodged the grab. I think I blocked one hit, got broke, hits me again, and then hits me a second time. This guy good. <laughs> now this guy would be probably easier to handle if you have like a heavy armor build. But at the same time, 
you wouldn't be able to dodge him effectively. Okay, he can uh, do two jumps. Oh god, he gets a lot of slashes. Okay, he's got like a range attack too. He has a little bit of everything. That one swipe hit me twice technically. Because I saw two damage meters pop up at the same time. And with each hit being around 1600, look at my max health. That's a hundred percent. All right, new strategy. We're gonna try low strikes, low stance strikes. Maybe I can poison him. My regular attacks, even on low stance, are pretty good. You know, if I actually get enough time to hit them. Whoa. Oh god, he's got like long ass slashes. Oh no, I thought I dodged it. Whoa. Oof. Okay, when he does that long range attack, it's like two attacks, but then he's open. So just side swipe them, and you're fine. Well, I guess some crows are gonna get your crops now, bitch! Whoa, is that a car wheel? I got him! Nice! I beat Shigazane. And what was that? Four tries? Five tries? Yeah, I can tell he was tough! Look at him! He's got like a bunch of Odachi stuck into his back. I'm sorry, dude, but that is not the right way to do acupuncture. Good lord. Do you believe 
everything you hear. Possessed by Bisha Centipede. Kind of reminds me of the uh, Great Centipede or the Giant Centipede that we saw in the mines back in Chugoku. A reunion with Hanzo. Alright, we're off to a really good start. Two episodes in and somehow defeated Shigazane. I did not expect to actually uh, beat him in that many tries. Okay, Book of Reincarnation, Soul Stones, Red Kappa Shell, and a Summoner's Candle. Nice. William, we can celebrate our being reunited later. There are more pressing matters at hand. After becoming yokai, the Kurohabaki have gathered at Aoba Castle, where Date Masamune holds court, along with an unknown amount of spirit stones from Tono. I fear the Date household plans to launch a rebellion against Lord Ieyasu. We must now we must act now to stop it. For now, you go on ahead. I will catch up with you later. I cannot leave Shigazane as he is. This method of using spirit stones to transform humans into yokai is just like what happened with Kelly. But with Shigazane and the Kirohabaki, will it even be possible? Alright, we got a new Twilight mission, the Murky Demon Realm unlocked. You know, just in case you want to actually try to take on Shigazane in the Twilight Realm. <laughs> Good luck with you on that one. Alright, so we knock, unlock the next mission, the One-Eyed Dragon's Castle, which only has six Kodama. But we also unlocked Wandering Child, Disturbances in the North, and a Gilded Deception. This one actually has nine Kodama. Nine Kadama for a sub mission. Is this game for real? All right, so this one just involves like finding Kadama. Disturbances in the north. Okay, so it looks like it's probably just fighting yokai. And a gilded deception. Oh, is this back to like the uh, ice level? Oh, interesting. And obviously, we're probably going to have to wait a while before we go to the One-Eyed Dragon's Castle. Level 165. This one's level 155. Which is only five away from Yokai Country. 158 and 160. So the main mission, of course, is the highest level of the four places we can go to next. So, I think we should stop here, and in the next part, let's go to Wandering Child. But before we do that, let's pay a visit to the blacksmith. Uh, of course, these are all maxed out, and just by doing this mission, it doesn't go up any higher. Alright, do we have another, uh... Plus two weapon to go with this. I can use the Nami Oyogi Kanimitsu. So I'm probably not using the Warrior of the West build anymore. And I can make this plus three. Let's do that. Now let's see if we can do anything with armor. The head's plus two. I don't think I have anything... Higher than that, or equal. So let's pass on it for now. This red demon armor is plus two. Now, alternatively, you can also take a bunch of plus ones of separate armor, make them plus two, and then combine it with this to be a plus three. Can I do that? I only have a plus. One plus one, so no. That is not gonna work. 
and I only have like a couple plus ones together. Therefore, what I should do is take this plus one and this plus one to make a plus two. And surprisingly, the soul matching is not that expensive. Now, if I can find an, two plus twos together, or even a plus three, then I can make that a plus four. Like what I got here. Okay, so I'm not going to get much done by way of armor, except... Let me take this. And make those a plus two. And then we'll take this. Combine it with that, then it becomes a plus three. So that's a pretty good strategy of being able to keep your armor and weapons highly upkept. Obviously, I'm not going to unlock any more dojo missions. Except if I want to like redo dojo missions, I can do them in the extra difficulty right here. Going to uh, Way of the Strong, which I'm not going to bother with. I am not ready to, like, tackle that difficulty in full, but one day it could happen. Oh, yeah, apparently I've never done this Twilight mission before, but I'm not going to bother with it. Anyway, I'm going to stop the video here at last, and in the next part, we are going to go to Wandering Child. See everyone. Thanks for watching.